Hello, I'm back, Lucha FM. Hope you haven't missed me too much. And where we left off last, basically, we finished the season. We finished eighth in the league in the end. We could have got second place in the end, but we, I think we drew, lost. I can't remember the last game of the season. So, oh, we lost. Yeah, we lost. So, yeah, so we lost and Grenoble lost. So it meant Grenoble was seventh in the league. But we're still eighth, which is really good considering we were only meant to avoid relegation. So that's good. And then obviously we've upgraded the facilities. We've maxed out literally everything now. We own the stadium. So hopefully we can expand that or build a new stadium eventually. And we're going to have a busy summer ahead of us. There might be a few players go in. There might be a few favourites of people might end up going if we get decent offers for them. So we'll just have to see how it goes. The one, the only one player I don't want to lose is one of the players I definitely don't want to lose is Kofi, and probably because they were amazing last season. But you know, if we get good enough offers, we we've, we've got a the whole purpose of the save is just to keep moving players on and replacing with the players on the new team. So we'll just see how that goes. But yeah. Anyway, I'll be back in a minute with the first bit of the episode. This episode is going to be a bit of a weird one because it's going to be little bits of clips put together because the fact is we won't have a game for a while because it's pre-season and stuff. So, yeah, just bear with us on that one. But, yeah, I'll be back in a second. Right, so we're back. What I decided to do, because there wasn't really much to talk about during pre-season and stuff, so I'm just going to do a quick summary now before our first game of the season against Clement Fort. So transfer-wise, we didn't really get rid of anyone. We didn't really have any decent offers. We sent a load of people out alone and uh, we released a few people. The big transfer was towards the end of last season when we sold Malcolm to already on for $2 million plus 30% of the profit of the next transfer. So obviously he will be sorely missed. But he wasn't happy in the tactic I'm using in the role that he's playing. So it was time to move him on. We managed to get a decent offer for him in the end. Two million. I would have liked more for him. But, I mean, you look at this. If he does well, he if he goes to, say, five million, we'll get 30% of the three million. Just under a million. So in the end, it'll work out pretty good. And then obviously, the better he does, the more money we'll make if they do sell him. So, yeah. So that's that. That's not really, like I said, there's not really much on the old transfer front. I'm trying to think what else. Let's have a look at pre-season. So pre-season, we did okay. We lost two and won two. So there's that. And then competitions-wise, let's have a look. But yeah, so there's that really. So we'll just we'll be starting the episode with the first game of season three. Yeah, I just didn't see the point in dedicating an episode to pre-season because I felt like it was just boring, really. It wasn't really worth doing. There we go. It's so the lineup for the first game of the season. We've got Popov in goal. Gavas is right back. Diabney and Bossy in centre defence. Bastian is left back. Tete and Drame in midfield, and then Fatar, Fassad on the wings, Kofi and Vaz up front. Weisbeck would normally be playing, but he, just before this game, he got injured for three or four weeks. He's not playing, that's why Fatar is in there, or else Fatar would probably be up front with Kofi again. Right, first highlight of the game goes to Clement. Clement, sorry. Clement will be looking to win this game because they got relegated, they want to probably get a good start in the league. So we've got to be at our best, and then we're doing well defensively so far that's one position that's like that's something we do need to strengthen through the youth intakes is get better defensive players we're doing or we're doing really well when it comes to the attacking players and defensively not so much tar with the corner now floats it in oh look at that for a blaster overhead of there that by bastia one nil up doing well so far in the first half nobody playing badly so far by the looks of it quiet first half not many highlights so far but if i win one nil first game of the season i'm all right with that players look motivated in this game that's not playing well though giving some encouragement hopefully that'll help it's had the reverse of what i wanted all right bizarre's coming off then we'll put kamara on there see how kamara does yeah i will miss viltage but he doesn't want to play in the tactic that i'm doing could have pushed him slightly forward in a more favourable position for him, but I don't want to tinker with what we've got because we did well. We've done well last season. We got eighth place. I feel like we can do better this season. So he had to go for that reason. He wasn't willing to settle in the tactic I was using, but I do what's best for the club. We're lacking strikers on the bench, so Carl Zenti will have to come on. Swap them over with then Drame can come off and we'll put on Acro and Galvez can come off on De Costa. There we go. Right. Not long now. Left of the game. Let's hope we can just keep this lead or extend it. Acra gives it to Costa. Arzenti with the ball. Passes it back to Diagne. I feel like we're lacking confidence here. I think we're going to... No, no, no. Prove me wrong. 
Right, Fatah drives it forward, passes it to Kazenta, and he loses it because it's Tessie. Go on, Tessie. Say the uh, replacement for Viltard is doing very well. Yeah, good. 2 0. Good start to the season. Passed in with the throw in. Passes it to Kamara. Kamara now. Oh, nearly. Right. Baxter wants to jump up. Ella, not, not during the game, please. Thank you. No, nope. it's him settled, hopefully. A good win to start the episode. And I'll be back in a sec with the next game against Kayan. We're, uh, we're back now. We've got Kayan in the next game. Pretty much unchanged team, I think. Galvez is not 100% because he had a picked up an injury. Dejo's in, actually, on the left. Tars on the right and then cut front. See how we get on. Nothing happening so far. First highlight of the game is to them. No, sorry, us. I apologise. We're in the white. That was Baxter, the dog yawning, by the way. Heard a weird noise. He had a mad 10 minutes where he went a bit crazy. He was trying to bite, not nip at me like puppies do. And uh, I'm hoping now he'll come. Yeah, he's, he's getting, he's going back to sleep again. Right, Kofi. Ooh, lucky. Corner to us. Headed out. Diving header by the opposition there. Kofi gets the ball back though, passes it across to Teta. Bastian now passes it in across, passes it inside to Fossi. Right, there we go. Nice little bit of passing going on here. Deho drives forward, loses the ball, unfortunately. I thought I'd give Deho another chance, and I think I'm regretting this now. Oh, good save. Baxter's not settling after all. Right, so offside by them. Still nil-nil though. Not too bad. Try and encourage the players a bit. Hopefully that'll help. Some people not performing at the moment, like Baz and uh, who else? Oh, I think it's just Baz at the moment, actually. All right. Try and encourage him, Baz. Hopefully that'll help. Oh, good interception there by Drame. They gives it to Kofi. Kofi. Oh, Kofi indeed scored his first goal. Fatah with the corner now. Floats it up. Headed out. Has another go at it. Drives inside the box. Passes it, but fails miserably with the pass. All right. Baz is coming off. So we'll have to do what we did like. Last game, and uh, we'll swap off the Kazenti. Fatar's not playing well either. Let's try and demand more of Fatar. Hopefully, that'll help. Changing his position might help him as well. Jay Home just lets the player go past him. Good tackle. Own goal by Bossy. He was doing well as well after, before that own goal. Right, Fatar had to come off. We've got De Costa in now, who's a right back. Means we can't take Galvez off. We don't drum it off though. Oh, actually, we can take off Galvez. Anybody else we could take off? Tete, maybe? Yeah, after Tete. And then we can take Deo off and put Kamala. All right, Mendy. All right, let's hope that all these substitutions will fix the problem. Actually, we need to put the Costa is playing up front. That's not happening because he's not a striker. Oh, no. I thought we were going to get the ball there. It's been a bit of a rubbish game this time. It's been boring and, and we're not been winning. So it's a combination of two. It's not good. Come on, let's get the ball. Let's not concede another one. Oh. Nearly pop up, nearly failed there. We can't take any more players off. Fire up. I'll have to see if I can fire up the players in a minute. Pop up is having an amazing game. He's he's made some really good saves in this this one. Let's see if we can get a late equaliser here. Oh, Kofi, you could have done better than that. FM fashion, we win one, we lose one. We'll probably win the next one, then lose the next one. Corner to them. I think they're just doing this on purpose now, wasting a bit of time. They're gonna score again in a second. Let's just see it. Oh, maybe not. Counter attack in here. No. Oh well. So we lost that one nil. Not the end of the world. Luckily, it's very early into the season. I hope we beat Mets in the next game. But we'll see in a minute. I'll be back in a sec. Right, we're back. Just a little bit of news before we start this game. He was moaning about the lack of first-team football. So he is, he has been offered out at 29 years old. He's been okay, cover, but just not good enough in the long run. So we'll just get rid of him. There's that, really. So that's another one of the old guard out, hopefully. But yeah, we've got, got in centre defence. But other than that, I think it's... Pretty much the same team as before. Hopefully we can beat FC Mets, but they will be a very strong team. They'll be one of the favourites to get promoted. First highlight goes to them annoyingly. I had a really, really fun save with FC Mets a few years ago. Managed to win the French Cup as well. Who no, I can't pronounce his name now. He managed to score a free kick to win the French Cup. Like I said, one of the most fun saves I've ever had. FC Mets have got a really good track record of producing good players. Like making players better. Sado Mane, I think he was in the FC Mets youth recruitment, uh, youth academy, sorry. And there's other players, but I can't remember the top of it. Actually, I'll be able to tell on here, actually. FC Mets, where are you? If we go on here, should be able to. It should say some of the form players on here as well, maybe. Robert Pierre's was one of them, I think. Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. But yeah, quite a fun save with FC Mets. I'm not actually, uh, I'm currently doing a, a save with Cadbury Athletic in the lower divisions of England. I've managed to get them promoted to the Southern Premier Midlands League, which is quite a few promotions up. I think the next one up is the Burana Rama North and South, and I'm currently in the playoffs with like two games to go. So yeah, 
So hopefully I can get promoted again with Cadbury Athletic. Yeah, quite a fun save with them. But once I achieve what I achieve with them, because we've still got a while left before FM25 comes out. And because I play at a, a certain fast speed playing this game, as people have noticed on here, I can get a season done pretty quickly. So yeah, so saves get pretty... I get bored of saves quicker than most because I can get a season done quicker than most. Take off the bars. Got to take off Galvez now. There we go. The Costa probably making his last appearance for us. All right, can we counter attack from this? Kofi going all the way here. Well, looks it. Go on, Kofi. Keep going. Oh my God! After all that, come on, Kofi. Well, that's that then. Two nil. We have not played well in this game. Play three games now. Only one one. That is not good. We can't keep making excuses for ourselves against these teams. Yeah, they are better than us, but we've still always got a chance. Well, we've at least got a consolation goal there. Give us a chance. Right, who else can we take off? Right, we've got... Can we get a consolation game, a goal? Sorry, Drama. Get in. Go on, we've got a slight chance now. Come on. I say that, a slight chance, but they'll probably, Mets will probably score again. When it's all said and done. Yeah, Mets probably going to score this now and completely kill our chances of getting a point out of this game. Ooh, oh, well. At least they didn't extend their lead. But yeah, could have done better. Right, then. I'll, I'll be back in a sec with the last game of the episode. Right, so we're playing Paris FC now. Yeah, pretty much the same team. I think it's exactly the same team, actually. I could be wrong. But anyway, let's see how we get on. First highlight goes to Paris FC. Ooh, and then he scored after four minutes played. That's not good. One to them now. Save. Throw into us. So right, Baxter's playing up. One minute he wants to sit on my lap, and then next he wants to go crazy. I can't settle him. So I do apologise for the if I'm slightly distracted. Yeah, Galvez, Drame, passing around here nicely, trying to start the play slowly. Oh, bit of tech is there by Bizarre to get past the player. Get in, go on back. There we are, VAR. I'll have to wait and see if this if this stands or not. Probably won't. Oh, it does. Good. Get in. Well done, Baz. Baz with his first goal of the season. Back up to eighth now. Win this game, it will be two wins and two losses for the season so far, which obviously with 50 50 50 50 i think it's 50 percent win streak win percentage then for the season let's be maths is letting me down but we've got to win this game and the paris fcr are a very good team corner to us we score this win the uh, winning the driving seat i can't get my words out today i'm so sorry i probably sound really boring I'm, i apologize i'm not the most exciting enthusiastic fm youtuber i can't be like lelouch i don't know what he's on to be constantly like that all the time he, he just seems so positive and happy a lot it doesn't help as well because obviously i wear a mask so it's hard to show facial emotions and stuff like that facial interactions right we're still one nil up though and hopefully we can extend our lead in the second half good little turn there by kofi that's a shame we didn't get past him then yeah go on kofi into the bottom corner there second goal of the season for kofi two nil up against paris fc which is really good to see bossy go on Zard. Get it. oh sorry all right i think it's pretty straightforward i think unless a player gets knackered now oh there we go Drame's knackered so we can come on for you Patar can come off on Fenty. bastian can come off because he's knackered and we'll put on costa i think that's it really is anybody else? But no, we can't take any more players off anyway. Right, we've just got to see this game out now. Corner, get another chance at it. Headed out, headed out again. Paris FC on the counter-attack now. Will they catch us out? Time will tell. Oh, no, going to come to our rescue. Let us keep our clean sheet, maybe. VAR, fortunately, goal awarded. Right, we just, I hope to God we don't concede again now. Oh, no, here we go. Oh, thank God for that. Right, hopefully, that's it. So that's that then. That's good. An average episode, two wins, two losses. Nothing in the middle. Let's just have a look at the league table before we go. Eighth at the moment. Four games played. Six points. Uh, we're, just a couple, we're just one point away from the playoffs. Only four points away from Troy's. But not too bad. We're doing well. I'm going to save this before I forget. But yeah, let me just do this. There we go. And yeah, thank you. Decent episode, this one. I appreciate your support. Um, if you haven't already, subscribe like the videos, leave me a comment as always. Enjoy the rest of your day and I'll be back. I'll be back on Friday with another episode. Goodbye. Bye.